things aren't as bad as they seem. Things could be worse. Things are difficult, and I admit I don't have everything I want in my life right now. Um, but so does everybody else not have what they want all the time, when they want it, etc. Others are also st- suffering and struggling, and I'm not the only one. I'm not the only one dealing with this sort of stuff. Things have been bad in the past, but I know that they can get better, and they do get better, and I've shown this already. Um, there's a million things also that I can be ha- grateful for and happy about in my life even if I don't have certain things that I'm focusing on generally. Um, I have a lot of love and blessings. I have various friends. Um, I have a healthy body. I have a lovely shower and nature. Nature is free and delicious. Um, I have faith that the future will get better and I can make it get better and I can make today better and work towards what I want. I have the power to relinquish resistance and I have the power to think more downstream, making life what seems to be so bad in some ways, when I focus that way, I can change my attitude and focus and make it look and appear much better than than it seems. And I'd really like to say it, it is much better than, than it seems. Like in reality, it's better than the way I can, than I look at it when I'm looking through the eyes of resistance and upstream thinking. So I can think either upstream or downstream and it's okay when I think upstream but then I have the power to think downstream and I can practice this and harness this ability. Um, There's a lot of love and appreciation for me in my life from people and my guides, angels and spirit world. I'm not alone. Um, even if I don't get what I want, I do believe that life and the universe can give me better things. Tests come and go. Life will be boring without challenges. I am willing to face my challenges head on, relinquishing resistance and facing life truthfully head on so that I can learn and grow. I have a really blessed gift of being able to learn and grow. I can, if I would choose to and focus, make the most of my hardships and challenges in life and I can do it with grace. I have the ability to open my heart and let go of the heavy burdens that I'm holding onto and I can actually gratefully have and share love, gratitude, appreciation and thanksgiving for other people in my life. Not only the people who are easy to love but the ones who are not so easy to love. I'm on a roll. Make, I'm laughing now. So there's a lot of goodness in life if we just take the time to think about it and realize. Even when we go walking on the street, there's trees, there's plants, there's bushes, there's birds, there's flowers, there's the sky, there's fresh air, there's the ground beneath our feet. Um, then, of course, we often have family who are still alive. And that's a blessing too. And no matter how bad a relationship has been, we always have the potential to make it a lot better. So life is full of opportunities and gifts, openness for things to happen, for things to become better. And sometimes it takes a while and we just I just take things one step at a time, one day at a time, focusing on downstream, listening to lovely music, speaking with supportive love, and basically making the most and making the best of what I've got. So when I focus all my energy and thoughts and imagination this way, I can feel much, 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 much better, get in the vortex more often. It doesn't have to be all the time, but it can be more than it was before, and I can be happy at any progress that I'm making. And I can go easy on myself with my thoughts. I don't have to be too expectant of everything being perfect all of the time i don't have to be i don't have to get what i want right away the way i want it i i can have the ability to trust the universe and be open to receiving in different ways and many times in the past i've also found out that when i think something good wasn't coming my way something good actually was coming my way sometimes when we break up from a relationship we find out and we're glad and we get a better relationship next time. 
And then, of course, we can just like laugh at ourselves for sometimes take looking at things so seriously and desperately. And then, of course, it's stuff like swimming in the lake, swimming in a river, swimming in the sea, having a bath with essential oils, having a shower, water therapy, walking barefoot, gardening, putting on some lovely music we like, singing, dancing, moving our body, exercising, rollerblading, running, hike, walking in nature, um, having pets on animals, having fun with our children, being silly, being playful, joking around, and loving and appreciating the people in our life. I'll say that one more time again. And just being happy with ourselves for becoming a better person and learning our lessons and making the most of everything. And um, all of our challenges will go, everything will pass, and then we're going to have a new challenge, <laughs> at least while we're still alive. So that's okay. That's the nature of